The moment fans spotted a very dark man on live video via his TikTok account where he was crying while listening to Fast and Simi song that say, Your father, oh, see me, see wala. I don't enter your wow, oh, you're my papa. I want to tell my mama, oh, see me, see wala. I don't enter your wow. Soja go, soja comes. My country, people don't be smart, you know. This has gone viral. I don't even understand what is in the ma mind of very dark man. Uh, this song is emotional. <laughs> <laughs> Cry no more, Daki. Cry no more, Dark Man. Everything gonna be all right, okay? My country people, we all know that um, all this, um, this thing is is almost getting to a week now since last week that very Dark Man leaked the audio voice record of um, Bobo Risky. It has been from one dragon to the other. So now, yesterday night, very Dark Man was spotted on his live video via his TikTok account where he was laughing cruising and um, fast um, soja music with um, Simi. So this guy was singing the song on more and he was shedding, well I say shedding tears, to the extent that he bent down his face and was like, the, the next thing he, he said was, this is so, this is so emotional. Anyway, Sha, this is latter news. So no matter what, cruise life, life is just once, it's not gonna be twice. Life is just once. There's no duplicate in life. Best word, don't buy, don't buy. Had it busy that is duplicate in life, you see how many people will be living their lives so carelessly. But there is no duplicate in this life. So live the life, you live your best life every day, like as if tomorrow doesn't exist. So live your best life every day. But don't live it as a foolish person. Live your life as a very wise and intelligent person. This is all I can say concerning all this ongoing saga. Anyway, Shia, um, I saw fast post, um, maybe that was two days ago, he said very dark man 24 hours. Maybe that was when um the message was sent to very dark man giving him 24 hours. But since then, fast have not come online to say any other thing again. Anyway, there are rumors that are still going on about fast. People are saying, um, because of this that very dark man said, and now a picture and video of um fast relating to Didi also was leaked. And uh, according to the news I'm seeing online, people are saying that. Fast lyrics on his news on his song, maybe the one he did with Didi after he met Didi. The lyrics he released after meeting Didi. The lyrics is all about this. Who are you to crucify the homosexuals? Fast defense homosexuality. The fast P Didi meeting and his encounter with Boboriski has revealed by very dark man has made people start digging deep about who fast. The bad, the bad guy really is. Now, this is uh, this is what people are posting on the social media app, and this is people's my um thoughts concerning all this ongoing saga. Because ever since very dark man posted something, but immediately very um fast, you know, responded with a lawsuit case for defamation of character and demanded an apology within twenty four hours. And fast sister, boom, come on her own. So fast began to you know question and began to dig more and more and more and more and more, just like Justin Barbie um. Um, was he passionate when he was still teenage, you know, in the Hollywood industry, that's the music industry in America. So the guy passed his message through his music. So it was now recently that people now discovered that, okay, this was what Justin Barbie has been saying all this way. No. Now people now went and listened to first song that he released after he met Diddy. So the song, we are like, ah, why, 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 why? People are like, we revisit his song titled Hypocrites. And in that song, Fast is defending homosexuality to the loudness of his tone. He says, who are you to crucify homosexuals? This, is, this in simple terms means people should let others be what they want to be. So this lyrics would make one think that Fast was simply comparing for, him, campaigning for himself and the likes of Boboriski. Or Bob Risky. So one could also think he's meeting, he's meeting with P. Diddy, that is Push Daddy was not just about music, which implicates him into what um, into what Didi is being accused of at the moment. So this song was released some years ago, and during that period, he also met with P. Didi, and they spent some quality time together. Our fans, this better not be true. This is our fans' reaction towards what is happening now between Very Dark Man, Bob Risky, 
Falana Falana and the fast also involved with the sister now. So making it about three people against one man. Will I say four people against one man? My country people, they say Wahala well, say be like bicycle. Don't tackle people when they tackle you. Although very dark man, very dark man say if that he'll be that disappointed if this thing happens to be true. He put in question mark. Do you understand? Or oh, no, he said he said uh, if. This is true that he'll be disappointed. I'll be fast they, himself, they do. It's just like a question that he is surprised yeah, about yeah. what he just listened. About the voice audio call he just, that, that was leaked, you know. When you listen to something that you don't, you, you don't feel like believing, you are surprised, you understand? That's, that you are, in fact, the kind of how that you are into, say, you don't even know how to classify and quantify it. That is the state that very dark man found himself. And that was why he put his caption question mark. It's like a question. Could this thing be true? I don't know. Who can verify? So it's, it's less for, for fast to come on and debunk and say, no, I don't do it. Or this is how it happened. Like the way, um, what is his name? Um, Abbe. Abbe responded to um, Bonner Boy asking him question about his link with Posh, um, Posh Daddy. You know, Veda, um, Bonner Boy, even though that he came out to, you know, debunk the news and tell people that, yeah, yeah. At least he didn't want ahead to sue um, Abbe. If you sue Abby, there are evidences online. Why is it that when you went to um, push, um, push daddy um, party, you wore woman heels? Why do you put on a lady heels? Not just that, you know, the video is there. He even went ahead and deleted all his tweets within, um, um, for him and, uh, and push daddy. No, you two and Nigeria are two, and Nigeria have already screenshotted everything and posted it on their own timeline. So you can't delete it forever. You can, you only delete it from your timeline. But others have it with your verified name being there written. Do you understand? So all these things, it is for you to just to come out and say, I didn't do it. Is it because your father is a lawyer or your sister is a lawyer or you yourself, you know that you are not going to pay any lawyer's fee? So that's why you think that filing for case is that is that easy? Do you understand? Anyway, she very dark man is not backing off on, on anything. And I believe that the guy will go and come back strongly. Yes. So in order to fight and curb corruption in Nigeria, man needs to stand firmly. The way to, had it been that Nigeria is not a corrupt country, Bob, Bob Risk or whatever he called himself would have served his six months term. That is the term given to him by the court of law in Nigeria in prison with other inmates. Yes, he will serve it there. And for him to come out, it will be next month, which is October 1st. Which you make Bobo risky, Bob risky, six months in prison. But no, he only stayed there for four months and they brought him out. Because they are tired of maybe keeping him indoor. He'll be sneaking to go out, not, not uh, posting anything online, but he'll be going out to have fun, to snap pictures, do what they are doing. Like very dark man say, this type of corruption, someone, if, if it happened, for instance, as Bob risky is, he might go out and kill somebody. Do you understand? Then the public will be thinking that, okay, Bob Risky has been sentenced in prison for six months, that he is in prison. He's not the one. Maybe someone saw him when he committed a crime, for instance. Do you understand? Let me say as a point of, as an, let me say as an example, I didn't say that it's what Bob Risky do. Do you understand? For instance, okay, let's say, um, like this Abuja area mama died. For instance, they say, okay, someone was sentenced in prison. So without knowing that the person was not actually in prison, they gave the person a special apartment. Instead of the person being in prison, the person still have freedom. So, for instance, that person that was sent to prison went and killed Abuja area mama. Do you get it? Now, and people that are free, you know, the, pub the public, the people are like, okay, how come this guy died? What happened? This and that. They began to do investigation and research. Hoping to what that maybe someone that saw um, the person that was sentenced to six months in prison, hey, is this person that did this? People will laugh at the person that is testifying. Probably they might even judge the person that you are laying a false -sided accusation on this person without knowing that what the person is saying is nothing but the truth. Do you understand it? Because the public, in the public mind, this person is in prison. I don't think, I don't know if you guys are getting what I'm saying. So the concern now should be, why did such thing happen? And the man that even identified, identified, identified himself as a bishop, I don't even understand if he actually listened to what he was actually saying on AIT News that time, two days ago. How can you say that there are a reason why you get Bobo Risky a special apartment, VIP apartment outside General Image apartment? That because his body looked like a woman, this and that, that and is that an excuse? 
provided the court proves and it went viral on that time during um, Boborisky trial time that Boborisky is still a man. That down there is still intact. Then what obstructed people from putting Boborisky in the right, rightful place as court, as court commands? You put it obey court order. So if this matter and this situation is being looked from the rightful point of view, Boborisky is going back to jail the second time to fulfill, to finish his term, to, to finish his sentence. If people don't know it. So let's just minimize the rates. We argue this and let the rightful thing be done. Thank God that the investigation is still ongoing now. So don't forget to subscribe. Tell us in the comment section your opinion regarding all this ongoing saga. Do you feel sorry for a very dark man? Do you, do you stand firm in very dark man? Don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for more.